was sexual subtext of the Chinese movie, Painted Skin. What is Painted Skin? A 30 minute video you can find on YouTube by searching Bo Jinming's Painted Skin in the search bar. It is a remake of a 2012 movie of the same name with gender swap characters. The characters are Zhao Wei, the fox demon, Wen Sheng, the husband of General Hua Pei Rong, and General Hua Pei Rong, Wen Sheng's wife. The movie tells the story of Zhao Wei who was rescued by Pei Rong after the heart stealing fox demon attacked his neighbors. He was brought back to Pei Rong's mansion where she lived together with her husband Wen Sheng. The two decided to let Zhao Wei stay with them since he did not have any other place to go. Pei Rong goes out daily to hide the literal heart stealing fox demon. Wen Cheng noticed that Xiao Wei had a crush on Hua Pei Rong, but he seemed to be unable to do anything about it except gaze longingly. Wen Cheng found out Xiao Wei is a demon. The two made a deal that Wen Cheng would literally exchange his heart with Xiao Wei so that Pei Rong would love him instead. Wen Cheng agreed, but Xiao Wei still made sure he couldn't talk so that Wen Cheng could not betray him. Wen Cheng was dragged out of the mansion and was publicly slandered and chased out of the town. Pei Rong still loved Wen Cheng despite knowing that he was a demon. She tried to look for Wen Cheng all over the place, but when she heard news of his death, she committed suicide not knowing that the demon was Xiao Wei all along right up until her death. In the final scene, Xiao Wei and Wen Sheng's ghost meet again. Zhao Wei gives Wen Sheng a piece of hair saying that if he carries Pei Rong's hair with him to his next reincarnation then he will be together with Pei Rong again. But the narrator says that Xiao Wei lied and that lock of hair was not Pei Rong's at all. In the movie The Love Triangle is between Zhao Wei, Pei Rong, and Wen Sheng who is married to and in love with Pei Rong. But Xiao Wei is also in love with Pei Rong after being saved by her. Pei Rong does not love Zhao Wei back, so Zio Wei does everything he can to win her over. Naturally, Zhao Wei would think that he and Wen Sheng are rivals fighting over Pei Rong's love. So he does nice things for Pei Rong right in front of Wen Sheng. He fixes her armor in front of Wen Sheng. Gives her tea in front of Wen Sheng. He gives her food in front of Wen Sheng. Every single time he does something nice for Pei Rong, he is always slyly looking over at Wen Sheng to see his reaction. Why is he looking at Wen Sheng after treating Pei Rong nicely? Why would Zhao Wei want to see Wen Sheng's jealous reaction over Pei Rong? But the subtext to love triangle in the movie is between Zhao Wei and Wen Sheng. Zhao Wei in the beginning may think that they are rivals, but Wen Sheng is somewhat attracted to Zhao Wei. This was before Zhao started being nice to Pei Rong making Wen Sheng feel rivalry toward him. Wen Sheng was attracted to Zhao Wei from the moment their eyes first met. Notice how long he stares into Zhao Wei's eyes at the end of the clip. Except he thinks back to Zhao Wei's eyes back in his bedroom with his wife sitting on the bed. He only snaps out of it when she calls his name. Even when Zhao Wei is not in the room, even when his wife is in the room, Wen Sheng still thinks about Zhao Wei. These clips show that Wang Sheng is always mesmerized to see Zhao Wei. Once he starts looking, he can't look away. In the third clip, his expression was mixed with surprise and happiness when he saw Zhao Wei coming towards him. But when Zhao Wei bypassed him and went straight Pei Rong, his face instantly dropped. The plot of the movie makes it easy to see that Wang Sheng is jealous of Zhao Wei. But this scene where Wang Sheng's face dropped when Zhao Wei passed him by and went to help Pei Rong with her armor. It can be concluded that Wang Sheng wanted the attention of Zhao Wei which Zhao Wei gave to Pei Rong. Wang Sheng watched Zhao Wei offer tea to Pei Rong. Technically Wang Sheng hurt his leg and thus is unable to fight alongside Pei Rong. If he was not hurt and came home after a fight, he would also be offered tea. His frustration with his broken leg is clear when he watches Pei Rong teaching Zhao Wei sword fighting and having fun. If his leg was not hurt he could also teach Zhao Wei sword fighting. Zhao Wei eventually comes to be attracted to Wang Sheng as well. But his feelings for his savior Pei Rong keeps making Wang Sheng out to be the rival. Or perhaps, Zhao Wei was attracted to Wang Sheng from the beginning and used Pei Rong as an excuse to keep messing with Wang Sheng. In the beginning of the movie Wang Sheng narrated the prologue of the movie describing Zhao Wei as fair-skinned person who refused to talk to strangers. 
But right after meeting Wang Sheng, a naked, soaking wet Zhao Wei revealed his name to Wang Sheng who was just bringing him clean clothes. After the bath scene, Wang Sheng asked Pei Rong about Zhao Wei, who revealed that she did not know Zhao Wei's name, and that Zhao Wei had only told her that he was an orphan who had lost everyone because of the heart-stealing demon. So my question is how could Zhao Wei tell Wang Sheng who he probably spoke to for the first time in the bath scene, his name so carelessly when he doesn't speak to strangers? Maybe it was a mistranslation. Or maybe Zhao Wei had this all planned. In the last scene Zhao Wei gave Wang Sheng supposedly a lock of Pei Rong's hair saying that if he held onto it while he reincarnated then Wang Sheng and Pei Rong would be together in their next life. But the narrator who is the blunt guy whose name I have no idea what it is because it was never mentioned in the movie or if it was my goldfish of the brain can't recall and leave me alone. Said that it was not Pei Rong's hair. After the sword fight Zhao Wei had with Wang Sheng where Wang Sheng's wooden sword turned into a real sword, the scene changed to Zhao Wei holding a lock of hair separate from his own. Do you know what this means? Zhao Wei could have planned everything. In the past he guided Wang Sheng's soul by giving his own hair to Wang Sheng so that they would meet in the next life, which is this life. Now Zhao Wei is giving him his hair to repeat the cycle once again so that they can meet in Wang Sheng's next life. Or maybe Zhao Wei just gave Wang Sheng a random person's hair just to watch him suffer and die alone in his next life. Although why he would carry around a random person's hair for his long life is beyond me. But if you choose to live in a world without miracles or cotton candy, who am I to argue with you? What I really want is some decent fan fiction about this 2020 remake of Painted Skin for all you writers out there. I will finish the rest of this analysis video of Wang Sheng and Zhao Wei in another video. Maybe if I have like 50 subscribers, or something where when I don't feel like a completely useless, terrible human being, whose worth is less than a rock. If you hate this video, please don't tell me. I'm sensitive.